What's up everybody, Danny's here and we are back at it again with another video. But before we get into it, make sure to check out all the links in the description below. And now that Luigi's Mansion 2 came out on the Nintendo Switch, and it was looking a lot like Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon on the Nintendo 3DS. So, most likely, I really like Luigi's Mansion on the Switch and on the 3DS as well, though. Now, what I want to start off right now looking forward to is Nintendo World Championship NES Edition. Now, this game is completely looking a lot like Super Mario Bros. 35, Tetris 99, Pac-Man 99, and most likely F-Zero 99, which is what I might get back to playing, F-Zero 99. But overall, it's a really success, though, Luigi's Mansion 2 on the Switch. Now, let's talk about something. So, I'm very sorry that I t said Zelda Echoes of Vision wrong instead of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. So, in my video I posted on TikTok, I made an apologize, and this time, I promise I will say Zelda Echoes of Wisdom instead of saying Echoes of Vision, which would be a terrible way to talk about this. <laughs> which would be a terrible way to talk about Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. Because honestly, I'm just terrible at naming games. Like Metroid Prime 4, it's now named Metroid Prime 4 Beyond. Now, pretty much though, we have two Metroid games, or no, three Metroid games already on the Switch. <laughs> yeah, we have Metroid Dread, Metroid Prime Remastered, and Metroid Prime 4 Beyond. I need to see Metroid Prime 2 Echoes and Metroid Prime 3 Corruptions. Now, that would be a really good idea. Because sometimes, in general, I don't talk about Metroid that much, but sometimes I don't talk about Pokemon or Fortnite or Minecraft that much. I talk about Mario the most, because as I can tell, I have a Mario shirt, of course, and I sometimes talk about Zelda as well. And Splatoon, I usually talk about it a little bit, but I might wait till Splatoon 4 comes out. Ooh, that might be a good idea. But um, for sure, though, Luigi's Mansion 2 already came out on the Nintendo Switch. Guys, what is the next Nintendo 3DS remake? Nintendo should add to the Nintendo Switch. Put it in the comments below. Let me know what game they should add. Probably Zelda. A Link Between Worlds. That would be a good idea. But hey, shout out to one of one of the comments who gave me the idea of making this video. Is Metroid Samus Returns and Zelda A Link Between Worlds porting on the Nintendo Switch? Will it be releasing on the Nintendo Switch? Let me know. But Actually, Zelda A Link Between Worlds should be a really good game that should come to the Nintendo Switch, is what I almost forgot. So today, now that Zelda Echoes of Wisdom already releasing on the Nintendo Switch, now that it's coming out on the Nintendo Switch in September 26th, so um, I'd say why not add Zelda A Link Between Worlds on the Nintendo Switch? They should do the same edit that they did as of Luigi's Mansion 2. Because I know for the Nintendo 3DS, there's a top screen for the gameplay and the bottom screen for the map. But that this should be the same thing for Zelda A Link Between Worlds. And same with Metroid Samus Returns though. If Met that would be a really good idea. That would be the same thing. They should have like a map screen at the corner with a minus, or actually in the right corner and that would be a really good idea. Same with Metroid Samus Returns. This should be really good for the Nintendo 3DS remakes on the Switch. Two of these games, Zelda A Link Between Worlds and Metroid Samus Returns. These two games should be a really good idea to be ported on the Switch though. And now, as much as I can tell, Nintendo is getting into the works of porting Nintendo 3DS games on the Switch though. But also, we have some games that are already announced on the Nintendo Switch. They have, like, a few games that it may be releasing later this year, like Mario & Luigi Brothership, Dragon Quest 2D Remake, Dragon Quest 3, and also Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. And for next year, Donkey Kong Country Returns HD and Metroid Prime 4 Beyond, but it's releasing in 2025, but we don't know the full release date yet. So it, may, it might be a good idea to port 
Zelda A Link Between Worlds and Metroid Samus Returns on the Switch, though. That would be a really good idea. But if you guys made this far, thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you guys think of Zelda A Link Between Worlds and Metroid Samus Returns releasing on the Nintendo Switch. Just like Luigi's Mansion 2 that they ported on the Nintendo Switch. So make sure y'all hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment and subscribe if you're new. Make sure you hit that bell notification every time you get notified when I post a video. Thank you all so much for watching. And as always, I will see you all next time. Peace.